Uh, how you guys doing? My name's Alex Stein. I have, uh, I'm really here because I'm upset about what happened with Lee Lewis and the gas explosion in October. And the reason why that connects with COVID is because what that did is my housekeeper, her mom was visiting us and you guys cut out the power. The entire dialysis machine did not work. So she ended up passing away. Now you guys have this school. I live on Westchester. You're not mandating vaccines. You're not mandating masks. I've lost multiple housekeepers. And let me tell you something, when the service sends a new housekeeper, their recipes are not the same. So I have two transgen transgender children at home and they are on uh, hormone blockers. They are immunocompromised. They live right next to this high school. If we do not make vaccines mandatory, I don't know what to tell you. Look at it. I don't care. A couple of kids get myocarditis. Listen, not a big deal. Um, that's gonna happen. You gotta look at the bigger picture. I got to stop losing housekeepers because inherently Josephina, no, this is how, this is, it's racist. It's racist by you guys not mandating vaccines because I'll tell you why. Josephina's five kids were living in my garage apartment. Josephina dies of COVID. All five of those children are gonna be enrolled in Highland Park ISD, all from El Salvador. None of them are gonna be in the school district anymore. Why? It keeps the school district white. So did you guys purposely do that? Are you guys purposely endangering children so that you don't have trans kids, you don't have, you know, kids that are from El Salvador. Because when I look at this and I look at you guys, it's all white people, it almost looks like the January 6th insurrection up here. You know, there's not a really good representation of the intersectionality of people that are being affected by COVID. And so you guys are just sitting here. We need needles in every kid's arms ASAP. Because if I lose one more housekeeper and I have to explain to Decca or Dallas why these people are dying and that you guys can stop it and that big, big school next door is killing people, that's on you guys. You guys are literally racist murderers by not mandating the vaccine. And you guys need to get shots in everybody's arms. I don't care if it's experimental. It doesn't matter. We doesn't need FDA approval. Vaccines and kids now. I'm not gonna lose another housekeeper. I'm not okay with it. You guys are literally killing my family's good vibes. So mandate vaccines. Thank you. Thank you guys. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, please.